Hi, this is Victoria Campisi with 1851 Franchise, and today I'm here with Mary Kronk of FranNet. Thank you so much for joining us today, Mary. Thank you, Victoria. Thanks for having me. Of course. So to get started, can you just tell me what makes you successful as a franchise broker? I think what makes me successful as a franchise broker is just that um, I actually have over 20 years experience. I have experience in owning franchises and I'm able to work with people on their overarching goals. You know, um, we take into consideration their financial goals, their skill sets, their lifestyle goals, where they really want to be with their business. And I take very seriously that this is something that is life changing for them. And I want to make sure that they're very happy with their decisions. Great. What advice do you have for people wanting to become franchise owners? Do your research. <laughs> make sure that you're getting all of your facts together before making a decision and really take it seriously. Understand that becoming part of a franchise, owning a franchise is becoming part of the family as well. And culture matters. Um, make sure that the business you're getting into, you actually have the skill sets to run and really be successful with, um, and that the franchisor can really train you and support you and really figuring that out through your research. Great. What does winning look like for you? What does winning look like for me? Uh, winning is getting down the road, hearing from my clients that they're really happy with their decisions that their businesses are running well, um, they feel well supported with the franchisors, um, it, that is winning. I, I, I love to see the success that other people have with these businesses. Great. What advice do you have for franchisors wanting your help on awarding more franchisees? You know, I think communication is key uh, between franchisors and folks like me and making sure that the client is getting what they need to make their very best decisions. So I would really encourage uh, franchisors to do things like have uh, their signature bar on every email, you know, make it easy for us to communicate if we need to pick up the phone or, or actually um, just be able to email back or text or something like that. I think that's really key. And then how can franchisors better communicate with you? I, I would just go back to that, um, just making sure that um, we have access to each other at all times. Um, I think, uh, you know, going back to the previous question, it's really helpful when franchisors have good systems in place that they're always working on making those things better. It's always going to make it more attractive for prospective franchisees. Perfect. Well, that's everything I have for you, Mary. Thanks so much for joining us today. Thank you so much for having me. I really appreciate it.